Hi, I'm Sarah Kamora, the Director of Education and Professional Practice, and I am here with um, a couple of our PPE coaches. I'm Melissa Thompson. Nicole, and I work in the operating room. I work in the operating room, too. So we have been um, doing a lot of work around PPE, or personal protective equipment, and one of the innovative ideas that came out of this process was that um, during the time where elective surgeries are not being performed, our OR staff, um, really, they are the experts in um, utilizing PPE um, and doing it in the correct way. And so we have brought them out onto our units to help our um, departments feel comfortable with the use of PPE. And um, the coaching has been a really big success. So what we're going to show you today is just the appropriate procedure for donning and doffing of PPE um, in the most simplest form. Okay, so I'm going to start with putting my gown on. You want to make sure that when you put your gown on, there's a little tab here. You want to make sure that that's secure. And then secure it around your waist. Then I'm going to put my cap on. Next, I'm going to don my mask. You want to make sure that the foam part, if you have a foam mask, is on the inside. I think a lot of the staff upstairs, they know how to don and doff, but it, this has been a good refresher for them. Next. I'll put on my eye protection and just make sure that I'm secure around my nose so I don't fog up. And then I'm going to put my gloves on and make sure that I seal so that no skin is showing. Now we're going to be performing doffing. Um, and we are, we're showing the doffing of personal protective equipment when leaving a patient care area or a patient care room. Um, there is a typical procedure for this, but during these um, difficult times and um, following the CDC recommendations and our recommendations from BILH, we actually have um, really evolved the, the extended wear of our PPE guidelines um, along with our um, conservation of PPE guidelines. So what we're going to show you now is really um, the doffing of the personal protective equipment uh, with some opportunity for extended wear of the um, surgical mask. Okay. So Melissa is going to start by taking off her gown. As she's taking it off, she's kind of folding it in and taking her gloves off all in one, so the clean side keeping it away from the body. Next, she's going to hand sanitize and apply a fresh pair of clean gloves. It's hard to put the gloves on sometimes when your hands are wet from the hand sanitizer. Yeah. <laughs> Next, she's going to take a uh, cabicide wipe to clean her shield that she can, so she can reuse it at another time. And notice I'm using this hand that has the opposite hand so that this one is dirty and this one is clean. Cleaning um, eye protection and the shield is part of our um, PPE conservation program. And then Melissa is going to keep her mask on because that is also part of the conservation plan where she's going to be reusing the mask to the end of the shift. And that's it. That's how you dock PPE.